Hi, welcome back. Quick change of plan this morning. Was due to be getting out in the North Pennines with my sister. The weather's uh, put a stop to that. So I've been on commute, picked a, a quick route out of the yacht, around about 70 odd mile. I think it's about 4,000 foot of elevation, uh, down through Middlesbrough. Anyway, I'm not even too sure where I'm going. So I've loaded it onto my Wahoo. Got a pocket full of snacks. We've got the Ribble ready to go. So we're just gonna have to get on with it, see what the weather brings us. It doesn't look too bad out there anyway, but in the Pennines apparently there's snow. So I'll see you back out on the road. There's the old transporter bridge in the distance. Like I said in the kitchen, I was supposed to be going out North Pennines with my sister. Uh, we had a look at the webcams online. There's been a lot of snow falling. So anyway, we cancelled that last night. We're not come out and I've just picked a ride out. I think it takes us into the top of the, the North Yorkshire Moors. About 70 mile, 75 miles, something like that. So we've got a pocket full of snacks. I've decided to put 40 grams of sugar into me uh, water bottles just an easy way of getting some extra carbs into us i think it's about four thousand foot of elevation on this so it's not mega bad but it's enough that's if old mr wahoo sends us the right way he's already sent us the wrong way already once Fucking bellend! Yeah, mate. Cheers. Ah, the lovely river teas. Then, an hour later. Right, you've had one of them days. 40 mile into my ride, had a mechanical, something went wrong with the derailleur, the rear derailleur on the DI2. So I ended up stuck in Middlesbrough for about three quarters of an hour till my brother come and got me. Just got in there, it took me five minutes to fix it. Fingers crossed, hopefully. So, scratch the ride that I was going to do. I'm just going to go for a pool about that, Nicole. <sighs> Proper fed up, anyway. Let's go and get some miles in. Let's try it again, shall we? T 
take two. Oh, what a day. I'm on the back roads around Hartlepool now. So originally supposed to be going out for a ride with my sister. Never happened because of the weather. Picked a new route, 14 mile in, mechanical. Nightmare. Stood on the side of the road for an hour. Brother come and got us in his van. Got home, it took me five minutes to fix. It's too late to go do that route now, it'll be dark by the time I got back. So just gonna try and get a few miles in. One of them fucking days. I think I know what happened with the mechanical with the derailer. I was playing about with it the other night. So I'm going to Mallorca. I've got myself one of them bike box Allens. And I was double checking it was fitting. Figured out I've got to take the rear derailleur off. Just in case the rear mech, the rear hanger gets bent. But I've got to do it anyway, just get it in the box. When I've tightened it up, maybe not tightened it up enough. Stupid, stupid, stupid! I've gone over a bump in Middlesbrough. It's just worked itself loose. And the rear derailleur was just hanging down. But I couldn't see what was wrong when I was on the side of the road. Anyway, once I got home, figured out it was a five minute fix. Back on the road now. Seems to be working all right. Fingers crossed. I'll tell you what, if anything else goes wrong again today, I'm selling my bikes. Bit of deja vu going down here again. Plenty of people want their fish and chips. Yeah, nice fish and chips down here, like. Back over the headland, about 25 mile in. What a day. I am glad that we grabbed the bike and came straight back out like once we got it fixed. No better than just being sat in the house with a salt on like. It's a sad, sad situation. I think we're going to get about 30, 40 miles in tops. This makes it worthwhile coming out, doesn't it? I am gutted that we never got to do the first ride, the one over in the Pennines. But then I was looking forward to doing the second ride, but I suppose it was me only daft, it was me only daft fault for not tightening up uh, the rear derailleur enough. What you live and you learn, don't you?
nearly home now. Let's see what we can do. Look at this. The last climb before we get home. It's only a little in, up in the Greek from village. Kills my legs though. That's it, last effort done. So let's go home. <laughs> back home, what a day. Made myself get back out then. Done about 40 miles. But one of them days today, we were supposed to go out to the Pennines with my sister. We didn't go because of the weather. So I made my own ride up and come out. Had a mechanical, 40 mile in, nightmare. Got back, fixed the bike, made myself go back out. As I've got back in, my sister's got in touch. She went to the chiropractor yesterday and she wasn't fit to ride today. So if we had gone to the Pennines, it wouldn't have worked. It just wasn't meant to be today. She packed their ride in after about half hour, I think. So just wasn't meant to be today. Anyway, back home now, just over 50 miles in total done today, but nothing like what he had planned. But it is what it is, isn't it? At least we got out. So now back in, hot shower, going to get tucked into one of these, I think. Picked that up yesterday, going to have that kind of monster and a baby bell. So hopefully next ride will be a bit, a bit better planned, a bit better look and a bit more elevation, a bit more miles and a bit more exciting because frankly that was crap. See you later. Ta-da.